Hey, how's it going? Good to have you back and welcome to the Live Another Life series and I'm going to spend the next few videos levelling up uh, in a slightly more organic way than usual. Now, if you're a new player, I strongly recommend you watch my best start for a new character playlist that shows you how to power level your character from leaving Helgen uh, to the stage where you're ready for the big guns and I'll leave a link to that in the video description. But with this character, I'm going to be doing things in a slightly more uh, organic way. Uh, but again, no cheating or exploits. Now, the first thing, as a red guard, we're pretty weak against magic and we have to build that resistance. So we're going to start with a lovely little quest called the Book of Love. And that will give us a 15% boost to our magic resistance. Uh, I'll cut out a lot of the travelling. Uh, as the video will be so long as there's a huge amount of travelling in this. Okay, let's go. Okay, I've already done this uh, video before, uh, but in a lot more detail. And this one, I'm just going to smash it out. So the first thing we've got to do is you've got to head over to Riften and the Temple of Mara. So we can actually begin this quest. So we'll head over to... Missfield Keep. Okay, and let's just pop around the corner. Now, a good thing about this as well, because it'll also give you the Amulet of Mara, which will, will enable you... <laughs> enable you to uh, get married, if that's what you want to do. And I'll certainly be getting married at some stage. Okay, and who we got to find now? We've got to find this girl. Hello, friend. Dianya Balu. Dinya Balu? We are devoted to the goddess Mara, who gave mortals the gift of love that they might have a hint of eternity. Her blessings are many. To love is to know the true nature of the gods. Ma receive her blessings. Not all can hear the broad echoes of deepest dawn. To receive the touch of Mara, you must first act as her hands in the world. Explore the facets of the infinite jewel. Are you prepared, then, to help bring the light across this land? Ooh, I am, I am. One surely opens upon you, child. You must bear its light that all may see. Mara has reflected an image to me. At the foot of the throat and the young woman, almost a girl. Her fickle love must resolve itself. The village of Iverstead. The woman, Fastred. This is the prayer heard by the goddess and relayed to her servants. Return when she has seen her path. I will entreat Mara on your behalf. That's very kind of you. Okay, let's go and see this fastrid person. Okay, I don't think we've been to Iverstead, so I'll cut out all the uh, travelling. Let's double check. No, okay, we'll mark it. Okay, where's the nearest place to it? Where's it? Fort Amal. We've just been there to get the bound bow. But yeah, we go from Fort Amal, I think. Yeah. Technically, White Run's closer, but uh, you have to go across the mountains. Okay, we've had uh, like loads and loads of ventures on the way, and uh, we just killed a, a frost troll here. And what I'm really pleased to see is old Sophia can ride a horse. Now, I've got to check see if I can get in Inigo to do it as well. I don't think he can. But it's kind of quite cool. Uh, but yeah, just a, a quick FYI, you're going to meet your troll if you come this way. So, and he's quite tough. So, there we go. Oh, there's Fastrid. That'd be really cool if we can get Inigo to uh, ride a horse quickly, nom the wheat. Will you use this at some stage? Nom nom. I'll just rock up and uh, rob and blind, nick the chicken eggs. That'll be lovely. Thank you. Nice little poached egg. Nom nom. Okay. Are you the one sent by Mara? Yes, what's troubling you? Bassianus wants to marry me. I think I love him. But he wants to move to Riften afterwards. And my father won't allow it. He only cares about this stupid town. But Bassianus makes me happier than anyone ever has. My mother's not any help either. You sound a little confused. They're both so amazing. 
Okay, so you've got to speak to uh, uh, Mum and Dad. I've got wheat to sell. Honest pay for honest work. Thank you very much. Nom nom. I've got potatoes to honest sell. Pay for honest work. Thank you very much. Your daughter asked me to speak to you. Probably something about the men. We all wish we had her problems. I don't tell my husband, but I don't have any problem with Bassianus. Even if it means her leaving Iverstead, I want Fastred to be happy. If they just snuck out of town together, I could manage my husband. What would inspire them to leave? Still so terrified of Yothor. If he knew that I'd keep him from hunting the poor boy down, he'd take Fastred to Riften without a second thought. Let him know that I'll watch out for them. I just want my daughter to be happy. Okay, we don't need to know anything about High Hrothgar at the moment. You're right, dude. My daughter's asked sure me to speak to you. She thinks she's in love with Bassianus and wants to leave town. Wait a Let me tell you how I see it. Until a few months ago, the girl was head over heels for Plymouth. Wouldn't stop talking about him. Now, if I thought she was really in love with Bassianus, that would be one thing. But she's a child. It will pass. Why do you want to stay so badly? Used to be a good sized town. Go on, Sophie, look at her. Get you back into it, girl. You think she'll get over it? You know how children are. Her fancies change with the moon. And like always, the boy lacks any kind of spine. A little push, and this will all be simple. Out of town okay, right, let's go and talk to the two dudes. Let's go and see the competition. And where is he? Okay, yeah, got two arrows up here. And I bet he's in the pub. I do think the bow of the hunt looks good in this, uh, this outfit. Anything I can get you, just let me know. Is it absolutely necessary for you to bother me right now? Both he said talk to you about Fastred. <sighs> what a boring conversation. Yep, you're an ass. You don't get her. Let's go and talk to the other guy. Good to see you. Oh, I can do this quest quite quickly. You have been having a bear problem? Hello, friend. Oops, miss that. You having a bear problem? Are you kidding? Those damn things will drive me right out of business. Tell you what, bring me ten of their pelts from anywhere in Skyrim. I'll gladly pay you for thinning out the herd. Okay, we can do right, this then. quite quickly. And we've got the magic bow of the hunt as well. Yay! Actually, the bow really is quite handy to have at uh, an early stage, so I reckon it's worth getting. I mean, the two bows I really went for. One was Creation Club mod, which you may or may not want. Uh, but the bound bow definitely. But this is a good little addition, I think. Passing through on your way to High Hrothgar, about to make a delivery. Oh, I hear you lost fast rate. I'm not sure what happened. One moment she's smiling at me, the next I can't even meet her eyes. I'll bet Bassianus would know what's going on. He understands women. Bassianus is an asshole. She probably appreciates assertive me? men. I mean, you should be bold. Tell her how I feel. He's what you got to lose, dude? No right. No fish was ever caught by staying away from the shore. I'm off to see her. Not today. I'm just not ready to make the climb to High Rothgar. The path isn't safe. <laughs> I love the script in the sky. Room. That's excellent. Uh, yeah, he's a nicer bloke than the other one, so uh, I'm sure she'd be happier with him. Go on then, dude. Chop, chop. Go on. Love waits for no one. Chop, chop. Our lives are just one big game. Like someone is sitting there playing with us, like some adult plaything. Yeah, I'm on there. No, master. I don't mean I that kind of adult. Clinic? What is it? I don't want you to leave Iverstead. Why not? Because I would miss you. But I thought you only cared about your fishing. What good are fish if you have to eat them alone? Oh, Clemic. Fastred, on the top. <laughs> <laughs> How is it now? That's it. Wilhelm said you saw you speaking to one of the pilgrims on the sudden death. 
Okay, right, uh, now we just head back to the temple of Mara. And let's have a little look. There you go. Pop into. There you go. And run down here. I like this little quest, it's, it's cool. It's a bit of a change from just going where and slaughtering things. Okay, where are you? There you go. Good to see you. I helped the young lovers in Iverstead. How wonderful. Like the sea, their love roils and swells, but brings life and nourishment to all. Does Mara require more of me? Carry the light. As you venture, Mara fills my mind ever more with visions of love in peril. Embers lie nestled in stone, needing only fuel to bloom a flame that will warm all around them. Go to Markarth. There you'll find Kalsomo, wise, acid, and reclusive. Help him to emerge and state his intentions. This is the prayer heard by the goddess and relayed to her servants. Okay, fair enough. Off we go to Markarth. Yeah, I haven't been there. I wasn't actually planning on just doing a little run to Markarth on foot. But uh, for sake of this quest, I think I'll take a carriage. I can always uh, explore down there later on, can't I? So... Yeah, it's going to take a bit of time. Shall I run it? I'm not sure. Should I run that or not? Actually, no, it'll take too long. I think I'll uh, head over to Whiterun and go to the stables down there. Yeah, I took the easy option. I took the carriage here, so, uh, yeah, I'll have to run that another time. For the sake of the video. Now, if you get in here, get prepared. There's a guy you can kill really quickly, um, and this helps you later on. But you've got to be so quick. Um, every time I do this, it takes about four attempts to stop him, so quick save before you go in. Yeah, if you want to, is have your weapons out, ready, and just kill this guy straight away. Just kill him. Kill him. Die. There you go. And then just put your weapons away pretty quickly. Just in case the guards turn on you. Which I didn't do then, so, but I got lucky. That was um, my fourth attempt to do that. Every time I do that, I struggle. So quick save just before you go in, get your weapons ready and just have at him. Uh, really tricky. And she gives you like um, a little bit of jewellery, which is actually good at this level. Thank you. Here. I was gonna bring this to my sister, but I think you should have it. But she's also handy for another quest later on, as, no. as we'll see. It's not a century saver, by the way. Um, so if you can't bother just don't bother. Okay. I've heard of them. Something about the men who live in the hills and attack caravans. I'm sorry. I don't know anymore. I'm just visiting here from Cyrodiil. Gods. Never come woman attacked right on the streets. And you always get this letter as well. Which uh, is a start for another quest if you read it. I'm so sorry. I hope the eight give you more peace in the future. Oh, I think you dropped this. Some kind of note. Looks important. Uh, is this your note? What does this mean? No, that's yours. Must have fallen out of your pocket. Hmm? No. Know anything about the I attack? Was just some fresh air. Add one too many pints of mead at the Silver Blood Inn. Okay, okay so if you read the notes, uh, it'll start a quest, and uh, he's a good-looking chap, isn't he? We'll meet him later on down the line. 
Okay, now when you come up here, I usually go the other way because there's some uh, vigil from uh, Stendhal, whatever they're called. You always stand there trying to drag you into a quest, which I don't want to do at the moment. No, Mash, you may do that one. Fairly soon because you get a decent Daedric weapon from it. Okay, so make your way up to Unstone Keep. I've got to say, this is my least favourite city in Skyrim. A lot of people love Markarth. The house is nice here, you can buy the player home. Uh, no good for kids though. Uh, but it's a nice home. I just don't like the city. I like white run solitude. Next season, nephew. Next season for sure. Next season for sure. What are you what? doing here? The excavation site is closed. I don't need any more Could workers or guards. Okay, and I was looking for you I actually. You I'm not hiring any more guards. Why do you people always bother me when I'm trying to finish my research? You idiot! Do you even know who I am? The most recognized scholar on the glimmer in all of Tamriel. And you people keep bothering me. I. I'm sorry, I. I got too excited. I'm in the middle of some very stressful work, and I, and I shouldn't have yelled. How can I help you? I've been sent by Mara to aid you. I was beginning to lose faith that any help would come. Ah, you see, I've been thinking about Feline quite a bit. You know Feline? Sorry, don't know her. Well, suffice to say she is resplendent, but not without resolve. Striking in all senses. The trouble is that I can't seem to speak around her. My mouth goes dry, and, and I start to shake. I could never hope to approach her. That You're probably overthinking this, dude. But she is as vulnerable as a saber cat. One wrong word. Yeah, I know women like that. <laughs> so quickly. Is there anyone who knows what she likes? She's quite popular with the ladies. Thankfully, Feline is not quite his type. But they've been friends for some time, and he may have some ideas. Please. Ask him what she likes. It's my only chance. Okay, we're going to go and get that. That's my little mug crab in the... Uh, that was running around there as well. I'll pick him up when I've got a home. Got him free on the Creation Club. Okay. And hopefully we catch him outside this time. And you don't know oh, there he is. Oh, is that bloody vigilant stand up? Bloody enough for you, outsider. More blood is always better. And you found your home, friend. Blood and silver are what flows through Markarth. Welcome. Oh, thank you very much. I've heard that you what? might know what Feline likes. Are you interested? It's not for me, it's for Calcimo. Calcimo? Is he interested in Feline? That sly old codger. I should have guessed. Good for him. For the both of them. Between you and me, she could use a bit of warmth. <laughs> As for what she might like... I didn't tell you this. Feline likes to act tough, but she really has a soft spot for, of all things, poetry. You know, I took some classes at the Bard's College as a youth. Poems come in handy when wooing. There's a poem I once used on an older lady of Rorikstead. I can change it to be about Feline, if you've got some gold. Are you prepared to receive my golden words? Yeah, you might as well pay. I have Wonderful. never won that I'll challenge, so, uh, so just pay it. So you need the you should probably gold. just take this directly to Feline. Wouldn't want the old ice brain stumbling over the words. Thank you for your time. Yeah, avoid that guy. Unless you want to do the quest. And it's not a bad little quest, by the way. So. In fact, I may just do it, just so I don't have to keep on dodging the bloke. Okay, and we run straight up towards the Yarl's room and then hook a right. Oh, 
skill book alteration. Oh, that's handy. Yeah, I'm going to try and power level alteration, and it's that and conjuration are the two skills I hate trying to increase quickly. Because uh, if you go, oh, okay, you have to wait here. Uh, there's there's no real shortcuts around it without cheating, really. But uh, I'll show you in one video before I just sit down and get it done. Yeah, conjuration and uh, alteration are a pain. Okay, she's still there. Okay, wait for a bit longer. Uh, what time is it? And she's gone. Oh. Back in the throne room, I bet. Yeah, there she is. You. Who are you to approach the Jarl of Markarth? I'm a traveller. I have questions. Very well. You may approach the mournful throne, but watch your words. Pardon me? I have a poem I'd like you to read. It's I'm from Calcimo. Sure Please. Give her this the poem. Lovely. Calcelmo wrote this? Or oh, Calcelmo, sorry. I never knew he had such feelings. He cares about you. I've never even thought of him in that manner. I wish that I was as skilled with words as he is. That yeah, steel armor gets his way. motor running. I may not be as eloquent as he is, but I hope he understands. Okay, let's have a look at her. What do you look like? She will destroy him. Must be our only concern. Poor old Git doesn't stand a chance. Cowards, both of you. Oh, I've put some uh, mods on which actually make some of the NPCs look better, and it's actually affected my characters as well. But rather than thought make her really pretty like I normally do, I've kind of given like a bit of an aged kind of uh, uh, look where she's. <sighs> Damn, wrong button. Um, well, she's kind of she's aged. She's, she's living through a hard life now. So I thought I'd give him more of a weathered look. You all right? You look like you might be sick. What is it, nephew? Can't you see I'm trying to think here? Oh come on! I just wanted to know if you needed anything. I always come miss on. the people no, I bring up nothing, with. Nothing at all. Are you sure? Okay. I have to study. What is it? Where are you? I've a letter from Feline. More than I could have hoped for. Have you really done this for me? I have to see her. Please excuse me. Come on, boy. Come on. Yes, yes, I have a lot of research. Go on, chop, chop. Go on, chop, chop. Fully mates, waits for no man. Come on. Go on, boy. Strike with the iron's hot. Cool. He's keen, isn't he? so nuanced I love you so I hear come here you Aikman, we need to talk about um, the silver blood family. that's it what about them? <laughs> they seem loyal enough oh loving Skyrim it's great okay where are we now uh, da -da -da -da. okay Oh, I haven't read that yet. I haven't bothered with that yet. That I've got to do. I'll just get this over and done with this one. I got it for free on the Creation Club, so I might as well grab it. And what I'll do is I'll just leave it in one of my homes when I get one. Okay, what have we got to say? I think oh, did you really now? And I'm assuming it's going to be under the scrolls of books. 
Got me in books. Ah, mud crab. There you go. 249. I'd already paid for it. Well, I didn't actually technically, I got it for free. Okay, see what else he's got. Okay. Conjure Familiar, Conjure Flame, Atronach, which I already got. Okay, I'll catch you look at those later on. Until next time. Right, let's get out of here and uh, get back to Riften. Where are we? Okay, down here. There you go. Okay, back to Riften. Where are you, Riften? Okay, right, let's head back. I've helped the forlorn lovers of Markarth. The goddess smiles at your efforts, child. The dawn shines bright upon you. You have seen the young, fickle love of youth and helped a more seasoned love find its way. There is one final aspect... I don't think Halsamo's going to survive it, to be fair. <laughs> He'd die with a smile on his face, so... You know, worse ways to go. Death. Take this symbol of Mara. She will guide you to the wandering souls of two whose love was so great that their entwinement binds them to this world. Okay, so... Right, see so yeah, how we've Take got to put on the amulet of Mara. There you go. Amulet of Mara, but there you go. Okay, this one involves a whole heap of travelling, so I'll cut most of this out. But the best way to go is really from, well, unless you discover other stuff near, but uh, I always find uh, white run stables. Yeah, that's the place to go from. Okay, eventually we got here, and you'll always find um, uh, little bits of random loot around here as well. And uh, some nommy nommy, bits and bobs. And yeah, don't forget to guys, keep on picking up all your ingredients as you go around. Oh, there's one, missed there. And Iron Sawn. Don't need that at the moment. And come on, nommy, 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 before we carry on. Okay. Okay, right. What are you doing? I'm searching for my Fenric. He was marching with Yukar's men, who they say were wiped out here. I've turned over every body, though, and I can't find him. Please help me look. He has a bright red beard and hair. Are you a the last battle here was hundreds of years ago. You. Even if you're blind, surely you can smell the blood. Come, help me search for Fenrir. He must be here somewhere. Ah, poor tormented soul looking for a man. Okay, so Fenric is miles over that way, uh, where we just came. In fact, we passed him on the way here. And to be fair, I think there is a, like a little cave or a mine 
that you can uh, you can find, which means you're closer to fast travel to if you want to do that. But we didn't. Okay, so don't pee off the giants. And and your wife is looking for you, dude. Where is she? We're expecting West in the plains over the mountain. Joker elected to camp here for the night. I don't like it though. Our fires are Why don't you like camping here? We're in a low valley. City ducks. If she's coming, they might take you to Ruki. It must be important. Lead on. I just need to report back to camp by sunrise. Okay. Right, and just simply run back again. Well, I guess you can fast travel if you want to. I never do. I, I don't know why. I never, I never do fast travel back, actually. I think it's kind of more in keeping of the uh, the quest. It, just feels, it feels more right to, to run back. And there you go. Of course I am. What brings you here? I had heard that Gukar's men were wiped out. I came to find you. But that battle isn't expected until tomorrow. Ruki, what's going on? I am so confused. What's happening? It doesn't matter. I'm here. We're together now. together forever that's nice okay right job done let's uh, go back to Riften it's a nice little quest this actually I do like it it does take a lot longer by the way than I'll show you on this video because there's an awful lot of running around um, but I think it's definitely worth, worth it for the reward you get okay And one of the reasons I always play as a Breton is you've got the magic resistance from the off. Which I think is a huge boost. And there she is. Good to see you. And Your I help the long dead lovers find each other. Province. I trust by now you've achieved a higher comprehension of love. Carry the blessings of Mara with you, so the rest of the province may shine with her glories. Okay, Agent of Mara has been added. Be careful out there. Thank you very much. Okay, so there's a little look effect. Oh, there you go. Fifteen percent. Where is it? I just lost it again. There you go. Increased magic resistance by 15%, which is uh, which is really, really good. And uh, I'll be doing something that, yeah, hit the terminal. Terminal. <laughs> yes, I'm listening. Anyway, clear our diseases. I'm here. Okay, Did now, you if you want to get married while you're here, speak to Maramel and just go through a whole load, load of dialogue, dialogue, dialogue and uh, you'll be able to have a marriage in the future, which I think you should do, really, but... Uh, it's up to you. A lot of players don't. Okay, that's it, guys. Back at our little campsite. I'm going to find a better place for this um, uh, to, to live in for a while. Um, but I kind of like it, actually. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And as I say, next um, video or two will be all about getting ready to uh, level up uh, uh, alteration, illusion, and uh, sneak as well. So. Uh, Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you found this useful. This definitely is worth doing. Catch you later. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like, leave a comment, and please do subscribe. If you'd like to see more videos like this, then push the bell next to the subscribe button after you subscribe, obviously. Later.